first of all for the state of Commonwealth of Pennsylvania, and then for a num number of other states. And the, these, these uh, lawsuits will be brought starting on Monday. But the first time it was discovered was here in Pennsylvania just a couple of days ago. Uh, the people you see behind me are just a few of about, I'd say, 50 to 60 poll watchers who will all testify that they were uniformly will wait. That they were uniformly uh, de deprived of their right to inspect any single part of the mail-in ballots. As you know from the very beginning, the mail-in ballots were a source of some degree of skepticism, if not a lot of skepticism, as being innately prone to fraud. The New York Times had uh, written that 10 years ago under other circumstances, but of course changed their mind once it was a situation involving uh, Pre President Trump. As a friend of mine says, I don't believe in conspiracies, but I also don't believe in coincidences. Kind of funny that all Republicans were rejected here and all Republicans were rejected in Pittsburgh and it amounts to about, gee, just about the 700,000 votes that President Trump was ahead by two days ago that disappeared. And we have no way of knowing because we were deprived of the right to inspect if, if a single one of those ballots is legitimate. That is unheard of, it's illegal, it's unconstitutional, and we will be bringing an action